Monday. It's Wednesday. It's literally Wednesday. <laughs> I'm filming a realistic day of my life in university. This morning was like pretty chill, pretty slow. I literally just got up, ate breakfast, got ready, and called it a day. And I've just been laying in my bed watching TikToks all morning, which is just not the greatest thing ever. But I have a class today, and it starts at 12, and it's 12.14. But I have a job interview at 12.30, so I wanted to do it in my room because the lighting's really nice. And then I'm going to go to class. My friends are saving me a spot, so bless their souls. Today shouldn't be too exciting. I have a lot of work to catch up on. So I really want to go to another building in my on campus. Honestly, working and stuff in my room is not very good. And I have videos to edit. I just have a lot of things to do. So I want to go to the SLC building afterwards. Maybe grab something from the coffee shop and just like chill and relax. Because I never even go there anyways. So I might as well just like explore. Explore everything today. Yeah. I'm so nervous for this job interview, guys. You have no idea. Like, I'm not nervous as in, like, if I don't get, I'll be pissed. But it's more like, I just need a job. So I just want to, like, get this one to just get the job search over with. I've applied to at least 10 places. And I've only gotten one interview so far. It would be quite literally the perfect job ever because it is a two-minute walk from where I live on campus. So if I don't get it, I'll cry. But it's okay. I actually won't. Like, I just, like, need something. Because I realize I have all my classes in the morning. And then I'm just so bored from, like, 12 to 6. Because I usually eat dinner around like seven and then go to the gym and then go to sleep so like i have nothing to do during that time so i really want to just like work make money like do my thing because yeah i know i'll have homework to do but i'm very good with like doing my homework or doing assignments before they're due so <sighs> yeah i'm just actually terrified guys i'm terrified and like usually i like don't say this stuff but like i'm saying it because i'm trying to be honest this is a realistic day in my life so <laughs> their interview is in 15 minutes so i'm just gonna should i do dishes i'm gonna do the dishes that's what i'm gonna do Oh yeah, one thing about me, I'm just gonna eat things and then leave it in my room dirty for days. It's disgusting. Literally disgusting. Explain to me why I had cereal like three days ago and why there's so many utensils in there. It's disgusting. I know. I don't want to talk about it. It just happens that way and I can't do really do anything about it. But I set an alarm on my phone. I have five minutes to do this and then I have three minutes to get ready for my interview and I'm actually gonna throw up. Let's just get into this because five minutes is to <clears throat> my voice is all my voice is like voicing right now, which is not okay. How do you even talk in an interview though? You gotta be like, hi, my name is Maya. <laughs> I have to just be like really myself and funny. I always get the job if I'm funny, but I can't be funny over Zoom. I mean you can, but it's just like scary because like you just don't know how to act. Like I'm more of like I'm an in-person person. Like talking on Zoom in classes, not my beef. Couldn't be me. Y'all stay safe though. It's just not for me. Okay, it starts in literally a minute. Already, so it is 12:31 p.m. I understand that not everyone. Is <laughs> so scary. I like. I can't take anything seriously. I just feel like I'm gonna laugh my whole entire time. But it was really good. The girl was really nice. So there's like two parts that I'm guessing. If I get a second interview, then they'll call me or she'll email me tomorrow night. By tomorrow night, and then there's an in-person interview, which I like better because it's so scary because there's so many people I get interviewed and like some people talk a lot during the questions. Like she asked you different questions. Some girls talk so much, and then I just like say what I need to say and then like wrap it up like you know what I mean like one girl talked for like 14 minutes but like I don't know if that's what you're supposed to do but I feel like that personally for me I'd be like girl you know what I mean like I just think that's annoying girls talk too much but like I talk when I need to talk I might answer the question and move on I'm not gonna talk for 14 hours we'll see what happens but I literally have to walk to class now because I have two hours left of it <laughs> lunch some fries cucumbers and some i think it's called bannock i have no idea what it's called but apparently it's good i just be eating it's all right it doesn't taste like anything it's what is it bread. supposed to be it's uneven bread like bread made with all yeast apparently all bread is good i don't no. think so but you said it's bread how do you not like it it's some bread's regular, bad it's regular ass bread yeah, but have you seen like that? The that aren't good are like different kinds of bread, like bread made with different shit. The original. Like the grainy? Bread, Do you like the like raisin brand ass bread? <laughs> these fries are colder than the Arctic. I eat these cucumbers every single day. I just ate and it was so yummy. 10 out of 10 snack. Jonathan, how was it? Solid 5 out of 10. <laughs> 
he's a picky eater that's why i just be eating anything and everything so warm finally inside i can go lay in my bed i'm so excited i've been waiting for this moment since i woke up this morning and it's so wet i'm soaking wet I'm gonna get changed because you know when you've been in jeans just for too long? Like the outfit's cute, but it's just like you need something comfortable on. That's how I'm feeling right now. I'm gonna change and then I gotta go do my laundry because I did half of it on Monday and then I still have to do the other half today. I have to tell y'all. Guess who got a second interview? Ah, me. I feel like I shouldn't be telling people or hyping this up because imagine I don't get the job. What a gag. But it's okay. Like, honestly, it's my first ever job interview experience in Toronto. Like, you don't always get the first one. You know what I mean? I'm just hoping that I get it. But you don't always get it. But, yeah, I'm just really excited. So, hopefully, hopefully I get it. <laughs> you put it in this one, right? Yeah, that one. Okay, because sometimes I feel like I do it like wrong and I'm like, down. The instructions are literally right there. I know, I know. Look at her taking two whole ass laundry machine machines for herself. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. And I had a lot of laundry, so. Uh, what is it, 16 and 15? Do I have one? <laughs> this is such a mess. Dude, imagine I forgot my card. You forgot your cards. No. Surprise, no. surprise. Jonathan, there's no way. Okay, so I ended up forgetting my card to like literally pay for my laundry. So I got that and now I'm just gonna sit here and edit my videos while my laundry's going. I think there's like 15, there's 15 minutes left. And then I gotta put it in the dryer, which is like 55 minutes. But I'll just be here chilling, sitting, and then I'm gonna take everything up and like get it together. And I'm accompanied by Jonathan, <laughs> who's hanging out with me while my laundry is doing itself. So, sure, it be really fun. It's genuinely the gloomiest day of all days today. Like the fog was fogging this morning, but it's really good day. I'm in a really good mood today, so nobody better ruin it for me, or it's Joe over. <laughs> Joe over for them. Okay, I can't get this out of my hair. I literally have the biggest headache known to mankind quite literally ever. I don't know what the issue is, but I feel like it could be because I wear my headphones like so much that it just like the pressure on my head. And I'm not really sure either because I always wear them. So it's like you would always get a headache. So I don't think that's the issue. I just don't know what the issue is. It could be because I didn't eat. I mean, I did. I ate lunch and breakfast and I never eat lunch ever. So the fact that it's just like happening today is really sending me over the edge. But I'm going to go get dinner in like five minutes. Hopefully it's like just not an issue. And I just hate when my body parts are hurting or in pain. I was leaving my period like three days ago, so I was already in pain. Like I just want to be like happy and not be in pain. You know what I mean? It's really not that hard and it shouldn't be that hard. What are that? What time is it? Anybody else have a trap phone? <laughs> I call it my trap phone, but it's literally just my old iPhone. I call it my trap phone, but it's literally just my old iPhone 7. And I use it for Spotify in my room in case I need to charge my phone. That's literally it. Also, this song, Hooks by Still Woozy, so good. I've been in my Still Woozy era because I just watched Anyone But You. I have the poster literally right here. I just watched it a few days ago and it's so good. I I love, I just love love. Like guys, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just trying to be in love. Like I love love stories so much. It's not even funny. So I was so happy and the soundtrack, everything is just so good. And they got Dominic Fike in there. When I heard Dominic Fike in the movie theater, I, I gasped for air. Tomorrow 2 song, Harge. Um, it's Point Me Two with um, it's called Point Me Two, Fendi the rapper and Cardi B. It's the oh my god, hello. Ugh, I'm so tired, but I have to go to the gym. I'm so tired. Say my vlog. Oh my god. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> and say hey to Harge. Don't show her your stomach. Oh, is that to her, Gina? How you doing? She said, How are you? Oh. But I'm gonna go anyways. Oh my god, I can't believe I just finished my workout. Like, I'm so tired. 
literally 2 24 a.m i just got off a facetime call with harge i was like cleaning my room and just like doing the absolute most but i'm gonna continue my night i'm gonna watch baddies till i go to bed because it's how i fall asleep i have to watch something i don't know why i can't just go to sleep like a normal human being i have to physically watch something to make my eyes close which i feel like is bad but if it works it works okay so i'm gonna do that overall today was so fun like it was a cute day like i really genuinely enjoyed my day today so i'm really happy about that and honestly this is realistic as it gets like i genuinely do the same thing every day but some days more exciting some days less exciting some days are like events and stuff some days i just like genuinely do nothing but today was a really good day i'm really like excited about my interview and everything so hopefully i can update you guys and tell you guys that i got the job i got the job i'm kidding <laughs> manifestation at its finest i really think you just gotta like romanticize going to school and university and stuff but it's really easy to romanticize for me because it's like downtown toronto you're in the city and i want to go so many places but it's just been raining and cold so when it's raining and cold and snowing i don't want to go anywhere thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys liked it and if you guys go to tmu Hey, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Every night fucks every day up. Every day catches the night up. Oh God, you should match it. It's that KO. No way lighter, still I fuck my 28th up. 1998, my family had the acrid. Oh.